According to the government, Canada's copyright law is designed to protect and create jobs in our digital economy. The federal government has passed updated copyright legislation that strives to strike a balance between the rights of creators of copyrighted works and the rights of users. Copyright on the internet falls under a bit of a gray area because copyright laws existed before the internet was invented. Currently, however, it is technically illegal to use random images, pieces of, pieces of audio, or video segments without the creator's permission from sources such as the YouTube, Flickr, Google, and SoundCloud. So for example, if I googled some images for an artifact I wanted to create for my portfolio, using these images without the artist's permission would be illegal, even though it might be really difficult or impossible, impossible for me to get a hold of the artist. That is why I will be using Creative Commons after learning about it this week for developing my artifact. If I use Creative Commons, I can find images, audio, and video segments that I can use without fear of copyright infringement. As we learned this week, Creative Commons is a nonprofit organization that aims to expand the range of creative works available for others to build upon legally and to share. As for my intellectual property, or in other words, the artifacts that I create, I want people to feel free to use them as building blocks. This is my philosophy because I feel that if I allow other people to use the artifacts that I create, then the message I am trying to spread will be spread further than if I try to restrict my artifacts to myself. Therefore, I will be making a bigger difference.